We're starting right off the bat. Welcome. This is Pikmin 3 Deluxe. You can see I've been playing a little couple shooters, couple little bit of good shoot on my Switch. Just on the go, generally. Um, but today, today, tonight, a little sniffly. It's the cold day that walked to work in the freezing cold weather. It started snowing today, too, so that's not a good omen. But Pikmin 3, I have played... It is very quiet. I've played a little bit. You know I did a stream a few months ago of Pikmin 3 on the Wii U. Um, and I think there I talked about how I did once have Pikmin 3. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that. I did once have Pikmin 3 as a kid. Um, but like an idiot, I gave it away to my buddy. I was just like, oh, you want the game? I'm not enjoying it too much. You might as well. Here. You can, uh... I'll let you borrow it. He never gave it back. Well, no, he did. Uh, and then I sold it for my Switch. <laughs> so. Yeah! Oh, man. I've been a little excited for this. I don't think I'm gonna do this at all on stream. I think I'm gonna do this. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do it that way. I'm just gonna do story. Because this is such a chill game. It's such a nice chill game. Um, I guess if you want part one of what I did, nah, nah, you shouldn't go watch part one. You should continue watching this. So we're gonna do a new game. Actually, I'm just gonna erase that. Uh, I might not, now that I think about it, because it might delete the Ultra Spicy unlock. So I want to play this on Ultra Spicy because I have a little bit of a history with Pikmin. I enjoyed watching Chugga Conroy's Let's Plays of Pikmin 1 and 2. Of ruin. Never watched Pikmin 3. The planet's name? Kopai. And, uh, yeah. A booming population, booming appetite. I kind of got addicted to playing the demo of this. I just kept playing it over and over, and I was just like, God, I want more. So their only hope is to find another planet. I'm gonna speed run like the first three days. Accordingly, they send unmanned scout vessels called sparrows out into space. To their dismay, the search is proving fruitless. <laughs> Just as they're about to give up. Forgot about all the puns. The final vessel reports back with news of a miraculous discovery. Wow. They mobilize to investigate the planet, which they name PNF-404. Wow! Kopai's last hope rests on three intrepid explorers. I forget if I played this in Simu or not. I don't think I did. I don't think I would've. The explorers 279... My computer would've just exploded, so I think I played it on the actual Wii U. As they initiate the landing sequence, something goes horribly wrong. How much do you want to bet, like, they just didn't account for atmosphere? Like, the planet's atmosphere? Like, other, like, their home world just doesn't, like, account for that or something? Or what if there's, like, a subnautica situation? Okay, the only thing I don't like as well is that I have to unlock the side story for Olimar and Louie. I think it's a sequel anyways, but like playing Pikmin 3 again, I don't really want to. Like if you if you had to play it again, I would say it's not good. Oh, look at him. Where am I? The last thing I remember was... This must be PNF 404. I love the little gibberish they, they talk. This doesn't seem very upscaled. So I, the Wii U gamepad had like a 480p screen. Um, Maybe it was even lower resolution. I actually know. Um, 
And so a lot of assets that were meant for the Wii U gamepad would be low resolution. It might be harder to see on Twitch, but... Cat and Charlie. Yeah, I forgot to put, I, I forgot to actually open Twitch to see what's going on. Gotta find Alf and Brittany. I only hope they survived. Yep. Yeah, there's hints now. So, I, I turned off the hints. Um, hint display. You can access them whenever. But I, I, I turned off the uh, the hint notification, because I don't need it. I really don't. I forget the controls from when I was playing the demo. Yeah. So I was a bit surprised at the pointer controls, because they feel really good. That's not a resync button, but button either. So even when I'm using my 8-bit dough controllers, the, um, the pointer feels fantastic. Better than, uh, Mario. Oh, still wants me to throw shit? Okay. I mean, kind of obviously using Joy-Con are still the best, or the, even the Pro Controller. Here, let me switch to the actual Pro Controller real quick. Because this, uh, whole pointer situation is a little fucky. Let me get my thing. Oh, God. You can hear my armpit. Ah. Uh, shit. There goes everything. Oh, God. Uh, fuck. I'm trying to, like, re- Why am I even, like, trying to get a, a, a plug? I can do this wirelessly. Dead? Okay, it might be dead. It is not dead. It is very much not dead. Okay. Cool. <laughs> now my mic is sideways. Alright. Let's just see how the pointer feels here. Well, it is desynced, first of all. And yeah, the pointer still feels better with the uh, original Pro Controller. It probably feels best with a Joy-Con. One thing I was a little bit disappointed in, actually, was there were no touchscreen controls. I'm gonna switch one more time. There were no touchscreen controls at all for handheld mode. Yeah, that just feels the most natural. In most scenarios, there's actually a lot of range of motion that the Joy-Con, like, affords you here. That just isn't as necessary. Um, for Pikmin. Like, Pikmin 3 specifically. I thought I missed a few Pikmin back here. Oh well, whatever. Let's just explore. Yeah, as much as I actually enjoy using the Joy-Con... Um...
Man, I don't know why the gyro in this, just generally, like gyro in most games is not great. Because I was using a Joyshock mapper. And it's got perfect calibration. Oh no! I think I'm still going to stick with the 8-bit dough controller, maybe? Oh god, he sounds like a baby. God, this game is gorgeous. It's still running in like 720p, but it didn't ma matter that much. Oi. It's a miracle. I'm alive. Somehow unharmed. Just as the SS Drake was about to land, we lost control and had to make an emergency escape. During the chaos, I was separated from my other two team members as well as the ship itself. Yep, so find the Drake. Yep, switching controllers again. That was a little Pikmin. Little Pick Boy. Look at him. Look at he. Alright, I, I don't care. I, I legitimately, I'm sorry, I don't care. I, I've played this like 10 times now. So you get your Pikmin, and you can order them around, and you can tell them to do shit. Um, let's get you. Come here. Come here, Pikboy. Okay. So we need this bridge. Hey, hey sorry, I'm tired. So that's one of the kind of new mechanics is you have charging. And with charging, you're able to just send them out and do stuff. Now, this is a bit of a compromise between how Pikmin uh, 3 and 1 and 2 worked. So in 1 and 2, you had this thing called sh dot charge. I, I, don't, I don't know what they called it, but it was, a, it was a move where you had your Pikmin and you would organize them in a straight line. Um, and they would, like, and you could point them in any direction, and you could, like, move them in a straight line from, uh, your captain. God, I'm so used to flick stick. Oh, they changed that. One of the things that... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, the Drake is over here. One of the things they changed in um, Pikmin 3 Deluxe is your Pikmin will be just... They'll all be just as fast as one another. So, if you're worried about... Um, how do I unlock on? Fuck off. So... If your Pikmin are, say... Now, oh, these guys are peaceful. These guys are fine. Yeah, I know. I'm playing on Ultra Spicy. I know how to play a fucking Pikmin game. God damn it. All right. Um, if they were flowers, they would move just as fast as all of your... They would move as fast as your captain, right? But if they're leaves or buds, they'll move a little bit slower. Leaves will move the slowest, buds will move second slowest, and flowers will move the fastest. 
and they'll also do the most damage. I think. I think that's a factor, I don't know. So they'll do work faster, and they will move faster. And that's really important. Because your Pikmin can get lost. They can, like, very often, like, get stuck behind stuff. And it's not fun when that happens, because you're just sort of micromanaging. Like, that's what the game- that's the name of the game, right? Micromanaging, but like, sure. You're not really micromanaging in a fun way. You're only micromanaging in like, oh, okay. My party's just like not following me now. Okay, fun, I guess. Oh, I can zoom in on in and out on the uh, on the map. Okay. Oh, and I don't have to call my Pikmin when they do the thing. Ah. Ultra spicy, and I think normal mode, um, or hard mode, sort of make the game, like, play like the original in some aspects. So this is not the original experience, um, by any stretch of the imagination. There are lots of things here that just aren't the same. Um, for example, normal mode, is actually easy mode. Don't be fooled by that title. It is a significantly easier mode than Pikmin 3. <laughs> and Pikmin 3 was already the easiest Pikmin by far. Bring him back. Where's he where's he going? What are you doing, buddy? <laughs> So here's the basic gameplay loop of Pikmin. You kill enemies, and find pellets, and you get more Pikmin. And there are limitations, you can't just do this forever. There will be a time limit. There's not one now, but there will be a time limit. <sighs> and you know, you just gotta finish your task for the day before the time's up. It's simple. It's a wildly effective gameplay style. That scared me. <laughs> I don't know why that scared me. I was- I'm, I am playing on Ultra Spicy. Um... But it seems like Ultra Spicy is gonna take aspects of Pikmin 3's original normal mode. Like, original gameplay difficulty. Oh. Oh, it's not going to show them to me immediately. I have to actually look at them. Oh, that's so nice of the game. So those are tutorials. That thing I just picked up is a tutorial. Um, but I don't have to read it if I don't really want to. Which is nice because I'm, you know... I'm going to end up playing this on my own time. And it's going to be a lot of fun. Break. There it is, the SS Drake. Incoming transmission, who could it be? Could it be Brittany? It's me, Brittany. Do you copy? Thank goodness you're at the SS Drake, right? And I'm starve. Okay. What's that strange sound? The sun is setting, which means nocturnal predators are waking up. Yeah. Should probably get off the planet surface for now. I kind of wonder if Pikmin are. Like... Of Earth. It, it, you know, the way that they rise with uh, the captain makes me think... Maybe they're not... Maybe they're alien. You never know. And there's the Unyacht. 
So you put Pikmin in the onion, and you take them out. <sighs> Most of the supplies you brought with us from Kopai were destroyed in the crash landing, so now we only have three days worth left of visions. So this is your time limit. You will run out of one bottle of juice per day. So we'll have to find some local food to get by. Yeah, I don't need to view the replay. No problem. We're shipwrecked on this planet. Some creatures called Pikmin helped me find the SS Drake, but our cosmic drive key is nowhere to be found. We won't be getting anywhere without that. Luckily, I made contact with Brittany and will set out to find her tomorrow. When I took off in the ship, the Onion took flight as well. Odd, but amazing. It is amazing. The whole game is amazing. It's a fantastic game. Now, I pers- again, I personally don't have that much uh, attachment to Pikmin. I'm not like Arlo, where I'm crazy about Pikmin, but I enjoy what I play, for the most part. It's a stressful-ass experience, because it's... not really what you think it's about. <laughs> Kind of about building your ranks and going to war. It is a real-time strategy game in like the vein of Command and Conquer and like StarCraft, but a lot more, I guess, interactive. I guess like personal, like a, on a much smaller scale. I guess I can go back to the tropical wilds, but I'm not going to right now. I'm just gonna go in here. Joy-Con thumbstick. Right. I don't know why I noticed dumb shit like that, where it's like, oh, it's the, it's not the the Wii U gamepad thumbstick, it's the the Joy-Con thumbstick. Like it makes sense, but at the same time, okay, he's installing stuff to the co-pad. Pikmin info. Yes, I'm just gonna move. Okay, that's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. You're gonna see me do that a lot. Ooh. Nice! Okay, just gonna go ahead and take care of that. Just gonna go ahead and take care of this. And then I sent him to just kind of wreck shit. So, in this version, you're only given 60 Pikmin. Or in this difficulty. And, you know... That is a big limitation, if I'm being honest. Now, as you can see, 30 Pikmin are doing just fine, but that's half my Pikmin. So, I can only really do two tasks at a time, if I really want to get stuff done fast. I don't know why that's so satisfying to me, the way that they all pick them up. Um, is there nectar around here? No. Oh, is there no nectar? Oh, wait a minute. There might be no nectar. 
and no grass. Hang on. I remember there being some over here. No. Oh, there's none. Dude. That's kind of huge. Because in other Pikmin games, I would always have, like, a decent amount of Pikmin that are... Um... Flowers? Pretty much exclusively based on the fact that I can... I can count on, uh, grass and, uh, like, nectar being around somewhere. Something can give me nectar to turn my leaves into flowers. But here... In, on this difficulty mode, that doesn't seem to be the case. Now, these Pikmin are following me just fine. They're not they're not really lagging behind, like, at all. But... That's something I thought they changed in this difficulty mode, but they didn't really. Okay, just gonna do that, do that. I'm just gonna have the rest of my Pikmin take care of that. Take that. I'm gonna pick those. So, I might have to leave Pikmin in the ground as flowers, or uh, to let them grow to be flowers. So I'm gonna take a decent number of Pikmin. How many do I need? Ten? Yeah. One more. I'm just gonna go a little bit, just gonna do some stuff. So I'm gonna leave those Pikmin in the ground and let them become flowers, maybe even overnight. But having to play with um, no flowers by default is not easy. Oh no! Look at her! There she is! Yeah. Just gonna... Yes, I will do. And there is a thing coming up here. What is that thing? What are you? I don't think he can kill my Pikmin, like, at all. There we go. No, you still can't kill my Pikmin. I I wish they'd went a step further with this difficulty mode. Are these creatures Pikmin too? Yes, they are. Okay, I know what you you can do. Yeah, that's something else they changed from the original. It's just the quality of life improvement. I know that um, having rock Pikmin bash their head at a wall doesn't do anywhere near as much damage to, uh, surfaces, like crystal surfaces, as throwing them. But now... Now I can just kind of... have them do. So I'm gonna want to put some Pikmin back in the onion. Yeah, and charging Pikmin only sends, like, a few. I am gonna want rock Pikmin to be flowers, though. Yeah, 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 yeah. The juice. So I got a bit of juice. Nope, other Pikmin. There we go. I might actually have to spend more days doing stuff. Oh, no. Yeah, so I have to do that, like, right away. I have to send- so, what they showed right there is that, um, more Pikmin won't be coming out of the onion. Uh, here. I will leave my rock Pikmin to take care of that thing. I think they'll be a decent while, so I'm just gonna let them do that. I'm gonna take, like, half of these Pikmin back here. In fact, I could just kind of, like, take all of them and put them back in the onion. 
Wow, they are taking a while to turn into flowers. Are they? Yeah, they are. Okay, one's budding. Oh boy, <laughs> this is going to be actually pretty difficult. There's a decent number of things about the game that are still just, like, too easy. Um, and I think this difficulty mode forcing me to, like, focus on a lot of different things also isn't exactly what I would have wanted in a more difficult Pikmin. Like, a more difficult Pikmin to me would be bosses doing a lot more damage and, um... It would also be, like, enemies being able to kill Pikmin. There are certain Pikmin now that just, like, don't, they just, they just like, don't get killed. Or no, they, like, there are certain enemies that just don't kill Pikmin anymore. Especially in, like, some of the same ways they used to. Oh, they just teleported me back. Whew! I can't tell you how happy I am to get out of this place. I'm sick of sleeping outside, and I'm super hungry. Uh, what's with your entourage there? What's that you say? They're called Pikmin? They're cute. But we don't have time for cuteness right now. Look over there, Alfie. Food. Huge piece of fruit. So I can lock on to... That's something else they changed, is if there's like a platforming bit you can do, you can just sort of lock on. You can just sort of like lock on to a, like a thing there. Five. Okay, perfect. Alright. I should have taken a few reds with me to do that. I didn't think bath that very hard, but whatever. I'm gonna go over here. Yeah, they're turning into uh, flowers. Uh, I'll take out 15. Man, a lot of my Pikmin are gonna end up being... leaves. Unless I can find, like, a, like... Yeah, a whole shitload of my Pikmin are gonna be leaves. Uh, hang on. There we go. Now, being a leaf isn't as bad. Yeah, I, I know about that. Go here. Yeah, I know. Why is it so selective with that here? Pikmin behavior. Yeah, I think it's for the most part just, uh, speed. Okay. I think I have enough reds for now, but... Ooh. I'm trying to get a good angle with this. Oh, there's not a lot of them there. Oh! Oh! No! I've never had to fight this thing with such few Pikmin before. Alright. That wasn't too hard, but... Ooh. Yeah, no, this is gonna be very difficult. Alright. No, could you, like... Lock. 
Okay. You just have to hit B. I'll give you one. Ooh. Okay. Oh, I see. Here's the thing I can do. So, they'll just kind of do that on their own. They'll go back and forth with the bridge. I don't have to worry about... ...plucking any more Pikmin. Having only five... ...Rock Pikmin is kind of a nightmare. Because Rock Pikmin are some of the most important uh, you can have on the field. And uh, I have to keep these Pikmin in the ground for them to turn into flowers. Oh, they're... Uh, they're still not even close. What the hell? Alright. So, like, most of- where are my reds, actually? Over there. Right, they're all being- yeah, they're all having stuff over there. Hmm. What a conundrum. Because buds are alright. Buds aren't the worst. But I want stuff to get done quickly. That's the problem. And I've never really had to focus on... Like, just building Pikmin before. Or like, just building my, uh... My ranks. That's something I could always, like, dedicate a day to. And then I would have just, like, a stockpile of Pikmin. I'd have, like, a hundred... I'd have, like, 150 Pikmin and I wouldn't have to worry. Like, ever. Because I'm too careful and I don't let my Pikmin die. Right, I have to go this way. Where am I going? It will be sundown soon, I know. So those Pikmin are all safe there. Okay, I have a, a decent number of rocks. Um, no Pikmin are in danger, so that's good. So I guess for now, I'll just create this bridge. And then sort of move on. I don't know how much more there is to really do here. Even the, uh, the rock Pikmin aren't- oh! Oh, I forgot about that. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna have enough time to get that fruit. That's the problem with having so few Pikmin, is you're just really limited... ...in what you can do. Okay, and there's you boys. Three. Okay. I'm actually gonna... Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no. Please. Make the bridge. Oh, you've done it! Okay. Well, that was a relatively productive day. I have to come back here and get all of these Pikmin, too. Oh... There'll be flowers by the next day, I'm fairly certain, but... I'd have to waste a whole day... ...just to get these Pikmin. Oh my god. I see how they changed the difficulty now. Yeah, fly Pikmin in the ground will be just fine. I don't actually have to worry about them. You can see the red and the gray onion are gonna merge in a second. There it is.
very interesting. The two of them merged into one. I'll have to make a note of this fascinating behavior. So I've only got the one fruit. Oh, <laughs> that is not a lot. Oh shit, what do I do? Oh no, do I worry about collecting fruit? Or... Ooh... If I have enough fruit to... make up for the next day... Shit. So if I have enough fruit to make up for the next day, that'll be fine, but... Yeah. Garden of Hope. Tropical Wilds. Wasn't the Garden of Hope in the first game? No, Forest of Hope was in the first game. Right. Okay, and they're flowers. Nice. Yeah, you can see the flowers are much faster. Uh, not gonna bother. Yeah, I need to open that up. I was thinking like, oh, okay, do I have to come back to this area? Or shouldn't I go to the snowy area next? But I've never actually... I don't have the means to get to the next area yet. Because I wasted so much time. Oh. Oh, by the way, I might have to go in like five minutes. Just like take a break and come back. Right. So you can see red flower Pikmin. Oh, that's so speedy. Just get on there. Okay, maybe not. Uh, might need to go find rock Pikmin. You go pluck them out of the ground. Oh, they are flowers. Okay, good. That's a lot. <laughs> That's like the majority. Okay, I can focus on like getting more reds now. Officially. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I've got way more rocks than I do reds. Overall. Hmm. Fucking something. Under my foot. No? Okay. <laughs> That's even enough. Yeah, you can see they do a lot more damage, and they all, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, they all, uh, work together better. Alright, now you, I send my reds on you, because you do fire damage and they're immune to fire.
Nice. Um, sure. What's today? Day four? throw Brittany over there. Um, and then I'll tell- oh! Tell you to make some of those. And I believe corresponding to the color of that, um, they'll be able to make more Pikmin of that type. Wallywog. Ooh. Not worth it with that few Pikmin, all right. No, 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 opposite. I just realized, wait, brain yacht, brain moment. Notice the flowers get stuff like this done a whole lot faster, so flowers are really important. Okay, it is done. Uh, bother with Alf? What are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? Where are you fucking going? Uh... Oh yeah, you guys. Nope, not worth it. Nice. You take care of you. I'll just like kill them for now. And then you're done. Nice. All right. We've done it. <sighs> every battle in this game is stressful because every Pikmin dies in one hit or about one hit. I wonder if Rock Pikmin even help with this. Seem to. So this is gonna be a bit of an issue of a fight coming up. There's a big cave. It's very ominous looking. And I do not need them to tell me that it's so ominous. <laughs> Like, I'm sorry, I don't. I just, I know it's an ominous cave. Like, come on. Yep, I know. It looks like some kind of nest. I wonder what hollowed this out. Yep. The Armored Maudad. Yep. Ah, uh, not there. No, 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 where are you fucking going? Please. Okay, stop. I need you to stop. Go. Oh, no, 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 no. I know how to juke this thing, but still. Okay. Oh my god, he has so much health now. Maybe, I don't know, was he, was he just like weaker on normal mode? That was too close. Uh, 
Go. Come on. All right. Now we switch to the reds. And they get on there. And they fuck him up from his tail. Oh. Yeah, um, on normal mode in deluxe, you can fuck this guy up in like one cycle. But here, not so much it seems. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, get up. Get up, everybody. He's coming. Here he comes. I get my pointer. Go for him. He's down. He's done. Oh, he's so close to being done. This is about as... I, I still gotta say, this is about as difficult as it was in the Wii U, though. Across the board, they have lowered his um, HP. Which is a disappointment. And yeah, um... What the fuck? Yeah, having this hard mode, um, where it's about as hard as the original, is nice. But I wasn't really asking for, like, a Pikmin 3 rebalancing. I just kind of wanted Pikmin 3. And in, in some ways, this isn't Pikmin 3. In some ways, this is, like, Pikmin 3.5, if that makes sense. And in many ways, that's good, <clears throat> but in some ways, it's not. Um, okay, there's a big fruit. I have to get this back there by the end of the day. I have to get the fruit back there by the end of the day. The fruit is kind of the most important thing. And it's clipping. Get on the fruit, not the maw, dad. Okay, they're at least trying to get to the f f fruit. Oh my god. Please. What are you doing, Pointer? I don't know what my Pointer is doing now. I'm trying to aim at the thing, and it's, it's not working. Oh, this is the only thing I can do today. In fact, I don't even think I have enough time to get everything over there. The Maw Dad is one thing. The corpse will go away and it'll be gone forever, but I need that fruit. Why is it stuck? What is happening? I didn't like that. Just as many as you can. Yeah, you can go to a new area with that. Okay, it's a little better. It's a lot better, actually. Just, just get on, just get on him. Just f fucking. Okay, I guess you can't. I guess twenty-three is the maximum. For some reason. Oh, now get in the onion. Beautiful. You know what? That's an accomplished day. All right, I'm gonna end the day. Oh.
so I'm already a bit conflicted. Um, they didn't give you the chance to play ultra spicy mode in the demo, and I knew it was gonna be like a mix between normal mode and, um, some harder difficulty things. But it's not really what I thought it was. This is the original Pikmin 3, um, with no nectar to upgrade your Pikmin to flowers, as far as I know. Um, and you have only the ability to use less Pikmin. Which means things will go slower, and you'll do less damage over time. And that's one way to increase difficulty, but rebalancing bosses and actually, you know, giving you less fruit and all that, that would be another. Anyways, for now, I gotta take a break. So I will be I will yeah, I'll, I'll, t I'll take a, I'll take a break right now and uh, we will be back in a few short minutes and by a few short minutes I mean like YouTube will see it instantly Twitch will see it in like a hot sec like I don't know how long it's gonna be like 30 minutes fuck all right be right back I think we're back okay so for those of you watching on YouTube you're not gonna understand uh, the stream killed itself. I don't know how, I don't, just, it, it just, it just died. So, we're gonna continue. <laughs> because, well, fuck me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yellowy Pikmin. Yellow. The light is so bright. Wow. I've done it. Another onion. So, yeah, yellow Pikmin. So electricity, um, I know that this is a dangerous hazard in Pikmin 2, like Pikmin 1 and 2, mostly because, uh, it was an insta-kill. Here, it just kind of stuns your Pikmin, so it's not really all that, uh, dangerous, which is a little bit disappointing, not gonna lie. I'll see what's up there in a hot second. Uh, yep, that's good. So we're gonna have some leaves for a while, unfortunately, no flowers for the yellow for the yellow boys. Um, but they got some hops. Yellow Pikmin have a whole shitload of hops to them. So I'm not actually too worried about that. Man, the uh, the radius on that whistle is ginormous. I forgot how massive it is. Fucking massive, mate. And there's not enough. So Brittany's trapped in this cave. There's a bit of a, a wall over here. Yeah. I can feel a draft coming in. I I know. And we can use those to, to, to fly. It's great. So after a while, Pikmin games eventually just kind of lose me. Like my eyes start to slide off and just don't just don't really continue playing. Like, they're solid, but, you know, eventually it, it's it's not as engaging, and I'm not even really certain why. Just eventually, I just kind of can't. 
Ooh, look at all that. What is that noise? Getting claustrophobic in that cave. Hey, there's Alf and the SS Drake. So this part of the game kind of forces you to uh, work independently with your captains. Hey, uh, Brittany, thank goodness you're okay. I see you're on the other side of the river. First priority is to reunite, so let's work together. Please give me instructions. Got it. That is if I don't die of starvation first. Man, Brittany is a fucking worry wart. <laughs> so what, I found a new type of Pikmin. Let me just like take out one. And just show you. Now it just kind of stuns them. Uh... I, th I think he's gonna die, but I'll, I'll just like leave him there. <laughs> G goodbye, Steve. You will be missed. Oh shit. Sixty exactly. All right, I'll bring out equal amounts of reds and. No, he's not gonna die. All right, it's fine. Um, where am I going? I'll have you guys dig that out. There we go. Nice and easy. Uh, there's a big cherry up there. I think I need yellows to do that. I need to find bridge pieces. Like, right away. Oh. I guess I have to throw them back and forth. Some yellows. First I'll have them take care of that. That is now open. I'm not a big fan of what's going on here, but I need that. Okay. What? Who died? What, three reds died? Oh! No! 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 <laughs> that was fucking dumb, dude. <laughs> okay. That part of the bridge is done. Oh, yeah, I remember this. Uh, she's gonna need some rocks. She's gonna need to get her rocks off, so... I will have Brittany. No. I don't like the way that that works at all. Why can't it just be on the D-pad? And like half of these functions just like a B. There's only one real function on the uh, on the damn damn. And it's just the uh, f fuck my brain. <laughs> it's just the hint system is on the plus button. Plus up. That's not good. I didn't want that. I am taking a hot while. No! 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 Wait, what? How'd you... 
What? You fucking tell him you you stuck through there. Oh, okay. I have to be way more careful. I'm gonna give you all of my rocks right now. You kind of need. These controls are fucking terrible. No. You can't do that. Yeah, 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 suck it to him. Yeah, something else important is that reds are more powerful. Ah, uh, did a couple of Pikmin die? Yeah, they did. Ooh. Just don't, just don't. Okay, I need my fighters over here. There we go. Just gonna bring you... Where's the yellows? Oh. Oh, they're going a long way, I forgot. Um... Looks a bit like the captain. Oh my god, it's the, um... The president. Who did make that? Yeah... Wait a minute. Yeah, they don't know where to go. Okay. Well, I will go over here, I guess. And I'll do my best to find some more... I don't like you. <laughs> I don't like the look of you. That thing's a little spooky looking. Okay, I need... Ugh, fuck. Oh wait, I'm not doing too bad on time, actually. Now that I think about it. It's just the waiting is kind of... Irritating. Um. What? What are you doing? What, what are you jackoffs doing down there? The fuck? That's not what I wanted to do. Okay, I'm just gonna deal with that. Because there's an enemy right there! I'm just gonna sneak past him. <laughs> That's really bad! Oh, and he's electric too. I need some- Oh, that's terrifying! Okay, Elomar, you need like 20 yellows. Um, where am I? There's a button. Okay, I guess I guess I'm doing that now. Just gonna just gonna move my ass on that one. 
on him. Get on his ass. Wait, are those? Oh, they are what they think. Oh. oh. Okay. My reds need that. No doubt. Yeah, I know. Yeah, there's only a set amount. So in other Pikmin, where are you fucking going? In, <laughs> in other Pikmin games, um, the way Nectar worked was... You wouldn't necessarily have... Um, different Pikmin. So it, w it wasn't a set amount of Nectar that there was. Each Pikmin that could latch on to the Nectar, um, effectively got part of that nectar. That is not all of the parts. Where's the rest of it? Is it this way? Oh, it is. Where are you assholes going? <gasps> Yikes! Get over here! Oh! Are there more enemies? I don't remember them being here. The fuck? Okay, go. Just fuck him up. Got him! Get out of there! Oh, this is stressful. This is really stressful. Oh, there's that one dude just kind of fucking working on it. Uh, that's fantastic. All right, go. Oh, I am not going to have enough juice. Olimar, or, uh, Alf. Where is the thing drifting? Um, I don't think that's all of the... Oh, that's close. All right. Um. Not yet. Yeah. Um. Maybe avoid you. Yeah, that's important. I'm gonna need that. And there's fruit. Whoa. Okay, maybe go that way. What? Okay, beautiful. Now Brittany can get over here. Um, and now that fruit. Where are my other... Oh shit, I gotta get over there. No. Why why are these buttons so confusing? All right, there is one Pikmin missing. Where is he? It's not a red. Uh Is it? Oh. Okay, Brittany, you're up. Oh, where is he? How do I get over there from here? Oh, I got to go all the way around. Oh, no. He's, he's gonna die. That yellow. Oh, he's so gonna die. Where are you, yellow? Oh, he's so dead. Never mind. Okay, so we're safe. Relatively. We're running low on juice. My god, this is a stressful game. <laughs> I don't think we increased our numbers at all, either. I think we lost mostly yellow and red Pikmin. And even some rocks. So we lost like 10, 10 or 12. That's not too bad. Right. 
I see. Oh shit, the yellows are in there too. Oh. I didn't know the yellows would do- that's interesting. Sunseed berry. Sunseed berry. Yeah, oh that's not enough juice. Tomorrow has to be focused on collecting fruit. Absolutely. Um, I'm not gonna do a boss. At all. Total 10. Wait, one at sunset. What? I lost the fucking... <laughs> what do you mean I lost him? I... Okay. Very interesting. So... <laughs> I, I guess the Pikmin are still but You know how they said they were going to fix the Pikmin AI? Oh, uh, they didn't. It kind of made it worse, from what I remember. Yeah, this is a really weird version of Pikmin 3. It feels like a remix. Okay. I would recommend Pikmin 3 not as um, a straight port of Pikmin 3. This is how I'm rationalizing it in my head. I would recommend Pikmin 3 as... A sort of Dark Souls Scholar of the First Sin kind of port. And sure, comparing it to Dark Souls, whatever. But Scholar of the First Sin was sort of like a Mario 2 remake. Or like a, like a Mario, you know, to Japan, like the Lost Levels sequel. Where it was very much... Um, not actually... Mm. Okay, I'm gonna immediately separate my captains, as well. I'm gonna use the go here function. I'm gonna tell you to take, like, half of the yellows. Some of those. I really wish the radius wasn't so massive. I could use a couple more yellows, actually. Yeah, about ten of each. And then I'm gonna tell you to go... over here. I'll, I'll tell you to grab that pretty much right away. Now, Brittany. You and the rest of the Pikmin are gonna go explore for some resources. Please. Okay, um, well, hang on. Uh, what else can Brittany do on her own? I'm gonna send Brittany that way. Okay, and I'm gonna tell you... I'm gonna tell the Reds more or less to take that. Can Ten take that? Oh, I know what I can do. Yeah. I don't really need to make more reds, so... For now... I'm just gonna worry about... Uh, taking care of that, actually. Now we got a geyser. Beautiful. Get him from the back. Fruit recovered, okay. Uh, I'll just take you, I guess. Yeah, this would be a lot better with multiplayer. 
let me tell you. Oh, and some of this. Because they're already doing it. Yeah, some of these fruits. Uh, blue pick. What the fuck? Where are they going? How are they doing that? Okay. Well, that's fine. Um, uh, my yellows. I guess they can make it up there. Eh, uh, maybe not. I need another captain to get up there. Okay. Where are you fucking taking them? What do you mean? What do you mean, my dude? What do you mean, my guy? Oh, he's planting them into the ground. Um, what do I want to do? Do I want Brittany to go the other way? Because I need to get that Pikmin. For now, I think... I think I'm actually gonna go around, back around this way. Where? What are you doing? No, no, it's fine. You don't need that much. You don't need that much juice. Fine. Fine, you can... Fuck. There you go. Just do it. I'm not positive what you're doing, but I think I like it. But for now... N no Follow me. <laughs> you fucking idiot. Oh, a Fantastic. Okay, so we found a few fruits. We found that cherry. Uh, there's a cherry over here. Actually. So, wait. This way. <laughs> Directions, what am I brain? Yeah. Uh yeah, okay, I'll do this. Take care of this thing. And my cursor is all over the place. I get it, she knows. Okay, so we got an easy way up and down over here now. Got an easy shortcut. Um. I'm gonna go ahead and throw Brittany. And give her some yellows to work with. Like, all of them. And you're gonna die. Nice. Oh shit, those grapes. Those grapes are important. Okay. What is happening to... Alf. Nice. What does this thing do? Oh, it's the whistle upgrade. I forgot. Should get it back to the Drake for a thorough analysis. Yeah. Oh, and they can find their way back up, no problem. Uh, Brittany did, or Alf didn't even need to be over there. All right, nice.
What? Oh, they can just like fumble their way over there? Oh. Analyzing. Yeah, you'll give me a whistle upgrade out of this, right? Receiving transmission from the Drake. Analyzing recovered item. Analysis complete. This is an optional part that adds a dodging feature to a regular whistle. Uh, plus. Oh. I can just dodge. Wait, really? Oh, that's actually great. Oh, no, that's fantastic. What am I talking about? Oh, no, 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 no. That's amazing. If the Pikmin dodge as well, that's that's kind of incredible. All right. Uh, what am I doing? Uh, yes, buttons. Uh, because there's Pikmin over here. I'm going to tell you to go take care of those fruits. And I want Alf to just kind of... Eh, I'll have the red... Eh, I guess you guys. Take care of that. I'm gonna need some... What the fuck? Needs to take care of that. I need more reds. Oh, there's achievements? Oh, right, there's achievements. I totally forgot. Uh, where's Brittany at? What are you up to? You and your Pikmin? Alright, just gonna... Let that happen, as it does. Uh, I still need more... Yeah, I need more yellows and I'm gonna need more rocks. All right, what do we got? What do you got for me? It's an incoming transmission from the Drake. Ultra spicy nectar. Yeah. Oh, I can jiggle it. Oh, it's like a like a little gumdrop. Press Y to use an ultra spicy spray. Oh, that's gonna suck. I don't want. I don't want it to be like that. The fuck. Explorers automatically collect ultra spicy nectar when they find it. Okay. So if I find red shit on the ground, I can pick it up. <laughs> Sounds good. I remember that being a lot more important in Pikmin 2. So... Am I gonna get... Okay, let's see. So I have zero yellows in the onion. That is made a, a gray. Okay, that is made a rock. So it's all entirely dependent on um, which Pikmin are carrying the thing, rather than which Pikmin are you know, doing the, the whatnot. So I need yellows, so I need Brittany. Okay, how much are you gonna give? How much do you need? Three, okay. That won't be a problem. And then I need yellows to go after that cherry. Huh? That's how you do that, right? Yes.
Okay, how many Pikmin? Okay, no Pikmin are in danger. Perfect. So we got ourselves a whole shitload of fruit. And there's this as well. That I could probably figure out. At some point. I don't have to go through the water, do I? No, this is a route for... Okay, cool. That's nice. What are you fucking doing? Oh, I can't throw a captain up there. Okay. Um, I think we have enough fruit for now, but... Mmm... I want to make a little bit of leeway, a little bit of headway... ...on... ...this giant piece of fruit over there. I want to see if I can even get up there. Now that I think about it. Um, none of you get the nectar. None of you get the nectar. Yes, okay. That's what I need to do. That is exactly what I need to do. Send my reds. Send Alf up there. Okay. Oh, there's only like three I need. Which way you going, son? The long way, it seems. Well, it's not getting back to the ship anytime soon, so I'm... ...not gonna worry about it. I don't like the delay on the whistle, they added. There's a weird delay. <sighs> okay. God, the thing's terrifying. What was I thinking? Bulbax? Bulblax? Fuck yeah. All right. I think we can get like a whole extra can of juice out of that. Or not. Oh no, that is not a lot. Sure is a wide variety of fruit on this planet. We didn't get a lot of juice! Oh no! That is not a lot of juice! In the original, you could have, like, a juice buffer of, like, 20. On ultra spicy mode. That is not the case. Oh, it's a problem. <laughs> okay. So we need to focus on two things at once here. Okay, so we have 120 reds. 
for now, we're gonna take out... ...20 of each. Okay. So there's a big damn cave. Uh... Okay, there's a cave there. <laughs> there's a fruit there, and there's a fruit up there. And there's a fruit there, but that's by water. Um... And there's a fruit up there. Hang on. Okay, I'm gonna send some yellows up there. Uh, maybe not that close. I'll give you like five. Send Brittany. Okay. Or not. What? Oh, right. Can I throw Brittany up there? No. Oh shit, I can't get up there at all. Well, how? Yeah, as a captain, it doesn't look like I can get up there. No, I can't. Okay. Okay, that one's a bust. Um... Can you use that go here function. Move optimally. Actually, I seem to move faster as the captain myself. For now, I'm gonna throw however many Pikmin I need onto that. Um... That's what I wanted. God fucking damn it. Sure, whatever. Uh, you go there. Brittany, you take them. And I want you to go there. And the fruit is behind Crystal. Okay. Brittany! Go there. I'm gonna take like half of your rock Pikmin. Brittany, what the fuck? Oh my God, if I can't separate them like by numbers, this is useless to me. Where are my reds? Right, they're over there. God, this is jank as fuck. Honestly, this whole go here system is, is jank as fuck. And it's kinda infuriating. Um, Alright. I hate that delay. Uh, 
Alright. And then you guys just all grab onto that. Okay. Now. No, it's all surrounded by water. There's not a lot else I can do. Two pieces of that uh, kiwi should be all right. Now that I think about it. Alright, I'm just gonna bring the rest of my rocks. Uh, I don't know where I'm gonna bring them. I don't know. New fruit recovered, new fruit recovered. Beautiful. Um... I guess I'll just hang out here. Okay, so we're missing a Pikmin. Oh. Okay, where's the single missing Pikmin? What the fuck? What? I, I would love to know this. Also, is there a way over there? Oh, I can get a captain over there. Okay, hmm. That could be more important. That could easily be more important than whatever Brittany's doing. But for now, I'm just going to check out what is over there. How do I get over there? I went too far. I, I, I think I might have I think I might have went too far in a few places. <clears throat> What is that? Is it just a single, like, pellet? I think it's just like a single pellet. I'm not gonna worry about that too much. I'm just gonna keep going. Because I have the time to get to them anyways. It's a big slide. No. Okay. Okay. I really hoped that just killed my Pikmin, by the way. <laughs> that would have been funny. <laughs> In like a really like cosmically cruel sense. Okay. I guess let's all go. Now where did those other Pikmin go? Did they uh, go back to the onion? I'm missing three. I think it was just like a... Uh, it's a random pellet. Where are they? Okay, there's one. Are they over there? I don't think- They might be there, but I don't think I can see them behind the onion. <clears throat> Whatever, if they're by the base, they're safe. Ooh. That's not good. That's bad. That's real bad. Okay, I'm gonna wait with one of my captains outside of this cave. <laughs> I 
I said I'm gonna wait with one of the captains outside the cave. I'm gonna take my reds. Beautiful. Ah, uh, going against two of them would be suicide. Yes. That's what I wanted. That's what I want to see. What are you doing? I said charge. Alright, that's good. Uh, okay, Brittany. Let's go back. Let's go, for, let's go follow Alf. This is a lot more fruitful than I had originally thought, by the way. Dandelions. Okay. I'm just gonna put that down and let the gyro reset. Is that cool? Are we Gucci? Yeah, we're good. We are, in fact, the Gucci, my guy. God, I hate myself. <laughs> so let's see what that does. It's light. Ah! Oh, look at that! Oh, and there's a fruit! Oh, there's not a fruit. Well, what did that do for me? Outside- oh, there is a fruit. Okay. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes. Very good. That looks like a big thing. Yeah, gyro drift. For fuck's sake. Okay, the gyro is drifting so badly that I actually don't want to use it. Alright. Oh, also, there's like no- okay, I just have to move the stick a little bit. That's not great. Oh, where's Brittany? I didn't realize it was still locked on. So while they're taking that back... Yeah, okay, we have, like, just enough. these leaves. I wouldn't worry. Ooh, this is where the captain's been. Do I have the time for this? If I don't do this now, um, I might just not have enough days, by the way. So, I might have to run. I might have to book it the hell out of here. Like, there's something here. Okay, where the fuck are they? <laughs> where, where are they? They're just gone. They've just, like, completely disappeared off the face of the earth. What? There's one there. What? There's one there. I don't know. You know what? It's two Pikmin. Doesn't matter.
Oh, fuck. Not certain I can do this, boss. Unless I can beat him in like 20 seconds, I don't think so. Getting the hell out of there. Nope, I'm pretty certain I can't do this. Oh boy. Get out of there. Nope, oh no, he doesn't want that to happen. Fuck him right up. This is not happening right now. No way. Oh, they spout little poisonlings. I'm pretty sure I can kill him, like, in one hit. Yeah. Nope, this ain't worth it. This ain't worth it, Chief. This ain't happening. Whatever, I lose two Pikmin. Big deal. <laughs> oh, no. This is, um, very similar to the whole dungeon mechanic, anyways. I like this boss a lot, too. Oh well. And we just make it back with the wonderful theme. <laughs> oh, this game is fantastic. I'm playing this off stream. That's... I'm just playing it off stream. <laughs> I'm sorry, my two rocks! They have a real crunchy dinner tonight. Let's see how much this is gonna give me. Not a lot. Oh my god, that is so little. Okay, we get- okay. We've made a single extra fruit buffer. We have one extra day. Okay. That's not a problem. That's manageable. That is entirely manageable. I didn't make too many Pikmin today, but... Hot on the trail of a monstrous creature. Oof. There is- yeah, there's a certain level of tension that can come with a Pikmin game. And this is meeting that level of tension. I didn't realize, so... I'm gonna just, like, sit and talk. No. Um, I'm just gonna kinda sit and talk. I'm gonna keep the gyro on for now. The way this game handled um, upscaling the difficulty is really interesting. I'm fairly certain hard mode is about on par with Pikmin 3 on Wii U. Um, I'm actually going to go back and check that out. Because I played this in the demo on normal and hard mode. Normal is much easier, just straight up. There's no way around it. 
I know normal is much easier. Hard is pretty good. Hard is like, you know, it's still an easy game. Now, I only got to do like the first two or three days, but it's still relatively easy. And with this one, it's actually like with this difficulty, ultra spicy. This feels more in line with Pikmin 1 and 2. This doesn't feel necessarily more in line with like a super hard mode or like a challenge mode. No, this just feels like what the game should have released as. So there is no... It's unfortunate because they dumbed down the difficulty in order to make it in line with the rest of the series and give you no option for more than that. Which is dumb and bad because this game never needed an easy mode to begin with. Um... But, hey, that's okay. For, like, a on-the-go Pikmin, dumbing down the difficulty is actually kind of alright. Like, just, be just being able to completely chill with this game is what a lot of people are looking for. Um, I was looking for something more in line with the first two games. Like, with the, the hard mode, I would not play on the ultra-spicy mode. I would play on hard mode and be like, okay, we'll see where we can go from here. Now, this is a little bit more difficult than Pikmin 1 and 2, from what I remember playing of Pikmin 1 and 2. I never beat either one, but I did get relatively far into 1. And, like, not very far at all into 2, but... There's a level of stress here that I haven't seen in a Pikmin game yet. And it is harder. But it's, it's more what I wanted, I think, out of this hard-ass difficulty. Now, I still don't know what the fuck I'm doing, but having this stress and having this difficulty option makes it a lot of fun for me. So, I'm gonna stick with it. This is a lot- this is cool. This is great. Pikmin 3 Deluxe. Um, if you own the original, now I guess I have to say... Do title screen. I guess I have to say, like, if you own the original, this is a good purchase. I would say this is a great purchase, actually. This is, like... Because it doesn't necessarily change, um, it doesn't necessarily, like... Invalidate your original purchase, because it's not Pikmin 3. It's Pikmin 3 Deluxe. It's Pikmin 3, but changed. It's a remixed version- it's a remixed version of Pikmin 3. And, um, if you own the original on Wii U, you can still go back and play that. And it's the original experience. Um, but I think this is a superior experience in a lot of ways. So, while it is unfortunate that the original is still trapped on Wii U, Pikmin 3 Deluxe is not a bad version. I'd highly recommend it. And I think if you were to get into Pikmin 3, this should be the way to do it. But I'll also say, if you're going to play Pikmin 3 Deluxe first, going back to the original might be difficult. It might be weird and, like, in some cases, straight up bad. And this sort of smooths over a lot of the rough edges that Pikmin 3 on the Wii U had originally, you know, been developed with. So that's my thoughts. It's good. I like it. I'm having a lot of fun. The hard mode is great. And, yeah, that's all I have to say. Also, uh, keep in mind, I could still be wrong about the, the, the difficulty scaling. I distinctly remember normal mode being much easier, much, much easier than Pikmin 3 and Wii U, but I might actually be wrong than that because it has been a, a few months since I played the Wii U version. So I'm just going to put that out there. <laughs> Should put that out there right in the beginning. I could be very wrong on that. <laughs> And you shouldn't take my word for it that normal mode is not the original experience. Um, but I don't believe it is. I'm actually going to go ahead and play them back to back and you'll see me tweet about that um, within like the next hour. So yeah, that's all I really have to say. I guess. So thanks for watching the stream. Holy shit. This stream is a bit of a nightmare. Um, but what, what, streams, what, what, what streams of mine aren't? 
So if you enjoyed the stream, you can check me out at youtube.com slash Samuel Knit, where we got the stream archive. You can see this in higher quality. You can see a bunch of my other streams. And uh, you can also join me on Twitter, where I have bad opinions, and you will see me tweet about this. I'm still gonna, I'm still gonna fucking do that. And you can check out the Discord. Discord link is in the description, and it is also in the channel description on Twitch. And if you're watching on YouTube, you can check me out at twitch.tv slash MrNet. Where you can chat. You can join the chat live, and you can be represented on screen, unlike on YouTube. Filthy VOD peasants. No, I'm kidding. I put a lot of work into those VODs. <laughs> I put more work than I should into the VODs. But yeah, so I will see you around, I guess. Thanks. Thanks for stopping by.